10 years of my life, I was bullied. At age 13, I was diagnosed with mental illness and placed on medication. And it was a very difficult time during those early high school years. Socially rejected, emotionally unstable, and academically disconnected. And for me, at that point in my life, it was just a matter of survival. It was a defining moment in my life, because I had a choice. I decided to step up and take control. I decided to become the leader of my life and not allow other people's opinions to dictate my reality. The starting point to becoming the leader of your life and taking control is self-awareness. Self-awareness to the things in your life that are holding you back in the classroom, on the sporting field, in the streets of life. The things that are holding you back from living a healthy life. And self-awareness requires deep reflection, it requires courage, and it requires brutal honesty. The first monkey I'd like to introduce you to is Enzo, the emotional monkey. And there's nothing wrong with having negative emotions because we're all human and we go through tough times at times. But it's about not letting those negative emotions take a hold of your life and allow it to bring you down for a prolonged period of time. Scooter, the social monkey. Think about the social factors in your life. More importantly, the people that you're hanging around in your life, your friendship circles. Ask yourself, are those people supporting and encouraging and helping your life move forward? Or are they having a negative impact on your life? Peer pressure is another thing that could lead to risky behavior as well. That could lead to damaging consequences. Daryl, the distracted monkey. Absolutely, social media. Those distractions can also lead to addictive behavior as well. But it becomes a problem when you allow it to take over your life and an excess use, usage of it. Because it has an impact, a negative impact on multiple areas of your life. Your studies, your, the quality of your relationships, your physical health. Tyson, the tough monkey. But you know what? The strongest people that I know are the ones who've had the courage to reach out and seek help. When you wake up every single morning, what do you see in the mirror? I know some of you guys are probably thinking, man, God definitely nailed it when he created me. Sexy beast. The sexy beast, absolutely. <laughs> do you see somebody with ambition, with drive? Do you see somebody with a positive attitude? It's important at this point in your life to dig deep and ask yourself, who do you want to be? Where you can tap into that driving force within you that exists within each and every one of you. Because guys, at the end of the day, your character is built on the values that you have. And good character is built on good values. If you don't stand for something in your life, you'll fall for anything. What's going to stop you from becoming the leader of your life? These five monkeys. Um, I found his presentation really great. It was motivating. Very relevant. He's very motivational. Relates to the students, comes to their level. I thought it was really awesome. It, um, it inspired me a lot. I definitely recommend this to other schools, uh, students and teachers. He has taught me lots of life skills that I need in life, such as self-belief. It was a really great presentation. It was very enthusiastic. You got the audience involved. The whole experience was um, highly eye-opening. Coming from a year 12 student, I did find it really helpful. I highly recommend that any school looking for a guest speaker to speak at their school to encourage students, he's definitely the person to go to. His delivery was very motivational to our kids. It really changed my perspective on a lot of things. Uh, I reckon it was brilliant, it was very good. I really enjoyed it and I thought it was really inspirational. I really liked how we got the crowd engaged. He should come to all the school in Australia. General provided energy, know-how, a wealth of experience and his own story touched everyone in a different way. What a great night and I know our Year 10 boys got a lot from it. Are you ready to get the monkeys off your back? Yeah! Today I decide, Today I decide. to step up and take control. Responsibility. To take full responsibility and to be the leader of my life.